This is a look at detail in the ear model here. This is the outer ear with the external auditory meatus that that pointer is pan, uh, passing through and touching the eardrum there or tympanic membrane. Next region of the ear going inward is the middle ear. The zone I am circling is the middle ear containing the hammer, anvil, and stirrup. Next will be the inner ear, this region here of that white curved structure called the osseous labyrinth. And the yellow coming out is the auditory nerve and the facial nerve. Now detailed parts in the middle ear. This is the hammer or malus coming off the eardrum. The line here separates to the next bone which is the anvil or incus. That then connects to the third bone of the middle ear there called the stapes or stirrup right there that attaches to the osseous labyrinth, the curves there at the oval window. Next this is the auditory tube or the pharyngeal tympanic tube. It balances air pressure between the pharynx, the nasal pharynx there, and the middle ear. Next are the three semicircular canals there, those curved loops as part of the osseous labyrinth in the middle ear. The other main structure of the osseous labyrinth is the cochlea and coming out of it is the auditory nerve there in yellow. However, the pointer here now pointing into that slot separates the auditory nerve from the facial nerve. The facial nerve has nothing to do with the process of hearing. 